Hey everyone, good evening. How is everyone doing today? <clears throat> I'm sorry. Last Thursday we couldn't conduct our session. There was some glitch in Wi-Fi or something. And yay, we are on today. <clears throat> I don't know what happened to my throat just now. It was perfectly fine when I was taking my skill-based classes. I was looking at our Discord and Ritu, you submitted this. This is really beautiful. Very beautiful. These white lines are like popping out so well and very nice. And in the art corner also, Lekia Bella, beautiful submission. This again, I was working in this project. And this again, Ritu, this is beautiful. Your lines are pretty good. Sabita, awesome. Very nice, Hemavati. You are trying pretty good. Linda, this is beautiful, awesome. I love the way you turn these corners around. Adishri, <coughs> Ananya, keep submitting like that, guys. I enjoy watching all these submissions and your submissions gives me lots of inspirations and we keep on going like that. Yay. And you know, I'm all set with my mandala series, the three mandalas which we are going to do in our mandala session and they all are based on the sacred geometry. I'm just going to give you a very quick glimpse of all three of the mandalas. They are based on the sacred geometry, the seed of life, fruit of life and the flower of life. Here you go. This is the seed of life. Let me just remove the pen. This is the seed of life, this is the fruit of life, and this one is the flower of life. So we are going to do these three in a row. And although I have decided others, but I haven't, I don't want to show them now. So yay. So three mandalas in a row are all set. And we are all set for our today's session. Let's start guys. So as you know, how we start our spiral art, we always start from the border. I hope you all are all set with the border. If not, then please start drawing now. If you want, you can use the ruler. If you want, you can draw freehand. It's absolutely up to you. After this, we are going to draw our string. So for the string, we are going to draw one square in the center of this page. It's okay if it's not absolutely in the center. If it's little bigger, smaller, doesn't matter. Try to draw a squarish shape in the center and Join all the four corners to the corner. And then find out the center of these lines. And And he, today is a little twist in the end. So first we'll complete all the uh, all around this square. And then there is a twist which we'll see at the very end of this work. Okay guys. So don't fill the center part until I start it. Here you go. We are all done with the string. Now I'm waiting for you guys to catch up to here. And then we'll draw together I'm waiting Diksha no worry take your time and write down in the chat when you guys are done till here thank you Ananya So 
सो गाइज हु इज ड्रॉइंग अलॉन्ग विद मी एंड हु इज जस्ट इंजॉइंग वॉचिंग थैंक यू दीक्षा राइट डाउन वन इफ यू आर ड्रॉइंग अलॉन्ग विद मी एंड राइट डाउन टू इफ यू आर जस्ट इंजॉइंग वॉचिंग थैंक यू अनन्या थैंक यू एडिश्री थैंक यू दीक्षा थैंक यू निश्मा अरुणा थैंक यू ऑसम गाइज let's start now i'm using my this regular pen as you know and we are starting from this top left corner and we are going to go clockwise so who is making the string sheet along with me at home is anyone making a string sheet the string which we are using in our these sessions write down in the chat if any one of you is making a string sheet at home a string sheet is like this kind of sheet like these okay aruna so like the this is the first sheet which has 20 strings and today is our 40th session guys so this is the again 20th string so we are then i write them back of each yes that's that's awesome idea i do that to nicole i do both of them both things so today is our 40th spiral art session because this is the 40th string when i'm looking at my chart we were supposed to do this next last thursday but there was some glitch as you know and now we are working on this left corner and we'll go anti clockwise now i'm going to turn it around and we are going to fill these two corners first absolutely the way we fill these two okay guys i'm going to turn around this and i'm going to turn around in all four ways then we'll fill these centers so now i'm going to start from this corner and we'll go clockwise so that will get a beautiful fan on the corner turn it to your right hand side and then work on the top two and then we keep on turning so that we we are done with all the corners we got a beautiful fan in the corner right Okay I'm waiting Nishma what I did I just made these two corners first this one clockwise this one anti clockwise it started from the both corners and then I just turned it around like that and then this one I started from the bottom so that I got this beautiful corner here and now we are going to work in this corner and for this corner we'll again work from the corner anti clockwise Can you wait a little bit? 
Okay. Okay, I'm waiting, Nishma. Take your time. Please write down in the chat when you are done till here so that we can catch up together. I'm putting the cup. I'm looking at the chat. Please write down in the chat, guys, when you are done till here. Awesome. Thank you, Adishri. Thank you, Ritu. Thank you, Ananya. So now I'm just turning it on the top again. So again, I'm getting these two one. So again, I'm going to start this one from this left top corner and this one from here, okay? I don't want to create that confusion so because we'll get the same effect basketball maybe you can additionally I'm not sure let's see if we can now we'll start from this left top corner I'm sorry I'm sorry this right top corner and we'll go left side so the anti-clockwise thanks for the subscription Sanbi Thank you. Thank you, Sanbi, for the subscription. So whoever is drawing along with me today or even just watching me, whoever is with me today, don't forget to click on the thumbs up button when you guys are done watching or drawing along with me okay because while watching or drawing it's difficult to uh, go to the like the menu and click on the thumbs up so once you are done watching then please go and click on the thumbs up button and if you want to write anything in the chat you can write after there too and don't forget to submit your artwork at the discord at the art corner I would like to see your artwork now I'm just turning it around yes Aranya you did it I know thank you Diksha now we are just left with these two corners and again this one we are going to start from this top left corner this one we are going to start from this top right corner this one is clockwise this one is anti-clockwise absolutely the same way Let's go. Thank you. 
Good morning, mom. So now here we are going to so pretty right so now is the twist part so in the twist part what are we going to do we are going to start from the top please look carefully once you know the process then the same process is we are going to repeat in all these four but not in the center part okay so for this one we are going to start from the top going left going right going top absolutely the way we do right and then again we are going to come back to the left going to the right so one round and then one round again so we keep changing the sides okay you can start from either side either the right or the left so go one round and then one round back and then one round and one round back that's how it's going to be so twisted spiral Every time the direction is going to change in all these triangles, these curvy triangles. Try to maintain the shape, the outer shape of the, the outer boundary of the shape. Try to make your spirals in the same way. So I'm just going to twist and this is the exactly we are going to repeat in all four. So the better way is to keep twisting your paper so that every single time you are going to get to your this curvilinear triangle on the top of it so that it will be easier for you to uh, repeat the same process all four sides. If you want you can go ahead and you can use some different color for all these four that will look very pretty you can use your own favorite color whatever is your favorite color is like any uh, any favorite any color will go in this one like whatever you want So if anyone is here with me who is not with me at discord so it would be great if you join the discord server and you can get the link in the chat so once you join the discord server you will uh, submit your artwork you can see other other participants artwork you can see all the schedule of all the live sessions which we used to do and all the patreon only sessions like the mandalas dot acrylic art acrylic art and all uh, free sessions like every Sundays and doodle every Thursdays and Tuesdays these spiral arts 
and we discuss a lot of other things you can discuss about any other artwork if you are working if you need any help any suggestions and so this is a very good art community we are creating at our discord everyone keeps submitting their work and any other work if they are working at home so yeah if you want to talk more about any creativity any art go ahead and join the discord it's just free So this Friday, Ankita is going to do her last acrylic art session, guys. And because she is very busy and now she is about to go to her college. So she'll take her last session. Yes, because she is also excited. She is conducting these sessions past two, three months every other week. She's taking and... I see your beautiful submissions of these beautiful acrylic art. Those are very easy and very quick art, quick acrylic art sessions she is taking. You guys can enjoy working with her. And the material list for those acrylic art which Ankita is conducting is there in the Discord in the material list channel. You can go ahead and you can check the material list if you want to see for the Friday session that is also available for everyone anyone can join it's at the same place where you are now at the youtube and the link will be available at discord and if you subscribe my channel the youtube will also send you the uh, some notification if you subscribe the channel and hit the notification bell so whenever we will go online you will get notification from the youtube also in that way you will never miss any live stream you will get through discord as well as through the youtube right yay how is it looking so excited now it's the time for the square so for the square it's just a very basic twist we have done that one once it's just repeated square spiral no slanted that's it just that straight spiral like in our no normal spiral art we always draw the slanted line in this spiral art we draw the straight line but absolutely the same way we keep on making lines we keep on keep on making these straight spirals until we reach to the core of this shape We did this twist once more again uh, if I remember if I see I think at number 34 number 34 I think yes we did it okay now it's the time for the shading quickly I'm great I, I took my 3b pencil and you see uh, alongside of these fans here you can blend with any blending tool if you have your blending stump you can get your blending stump if you have any q-tip you can get q-tip if you have any cotton balls you can use any cotton balls you can use any tissue paper you can fold your tissue paper and you can use it 
you can use anything to blend whatever is available and now just around the square or the rectangular shape or the square shape which we drew in the center you know you can go ahead and you if you have any thin gray marker pen you can go ahead and you can uh, like give little shading at every these square and it will give so beautiful 3 d look as if like these are the like the well or the stairs they are going in and in like kind of very beautiful 3d illusion you can create like that so if you are doing with the pencil like i am doing so try not to use the q-tip or anything else like use a very thin uh, very thin blending stump because lines are very thin otherwise you can just leave it like that it will also look nice but for these borders you can use anything like i have kept my used q-tip in a pouch and i use them until they, they, like they are kind of all used up and they are really very useful for some kind of soft blending and these kind of loose blending but they are not very good for these kind of precision blending as you see in the center part because if you use these q-tip for this center part it, it will fill all the way because they are very thin lines so we should avoid using q-tips for them you can use like these kind of little blending stumps for these center parts or the thin gray marker pen or you can just leave them like that otherwise that is also like the good way now you see here inside this triangle i'm just doing this uh, inside the triangle just the soft blending with the used q-tip okay so i didn't lay down any graphite here as you see but i want to make this triangle little pop out yay i'm just folding my paper other way around so that it becomes flat okay here you go beautiful how is it looking like as you see i'm quickly using my this blending stump just to make it I'm making it really dark in the center here. We are done. What is the last thing, guys? Do you guys remember or forgot? What is the last thing? Yes, sign and date and praise. Yay. <laughs> yes so you can write your full name your just initials whatever you want and today is 7.21.20 date and the last and the most important thing is to praise because this is such a beautiful way we spend our this half an hour this 30 minute creatively and we made this beautiful abstract art and this is absolutely your own original art and you can go ahead and you can fill colors you can give more depth you can uh, use more whatever kind of medium like crayons marker pens and beautiful variation shade like you can make these four petals with the green color or whatever pink color and these triangles with different color and I can't wait to see your submissions guys because I'm sure you guys are gonna rock and you guys are going to put a lot of elements and it's still like you you can just keep it like that and it is looking beautiful this is our 40th spiral art session I'm so excited 
and we keep on continue this as I'm getting so much love and so much submissions and imagination is the only limit because we can go ahead on and on and on with these kind of spider art. Okay guys, time to say goodbye, enjoy and don't forget to praise yourself. Good job Nidhi Prakash, you did awesome. You can say the same words for yourself. Bye guys, see you on Thursday.